really is nothing that can make the immediate overwhelming sense of grief go away. A tragic accident leaves a community in mourning. That community is mourning along with a Utah County family who lost their son following a tragic farm accident yesterday afternoon. The boy's name was released earlier today and new specialist Garna Mejia has been in contact with family members. Garna, such a devastating loss for this family. Yeah, good evening, Dan, and that's exactly right. Yesterday's accident hits home for every parent. 12-year-old George, George Dunbar Oldham was described as the oldest of five siblings, and he had a love for life. Late last night, George Dunbar Oldham's mom shared her thoughts on Facebook, saying in part, this is a post I thought I would never in my life write, but I couldn't close my eyes after today without thanking George and Heavenly Father for letting me be his mom for 12 amazing years. I have wet my pillow with tears looking at pictures from his life. He brought so much joy to our family. George's mom shared he was the leader of the pack and best friend to his four siblings. They lived in several states, including Missouri, Michigan, and Montana, before settling back in Utah County. Yesterday, George was out in his family's field in Palmyra with his dad and brother. The two brothers were riding bicycles, and the father was driving a side-by-side a -side with some kind of a farm trailer behind it. That's when deputies say George fell onto the path of the farm equipment his dad was driving. We don't know exactly what happened except that uh, the boy fell and uh, ended up getting hit by the equipment. Uh, and he sustained serious head injuries. Despite multiple attempts to revive him by family and first responders, George did not survive. His injuries were too severe and they were unable to uh, revive him and he was pronounced dead at the scene. As George's family and community mourn his loss, they take comfort in their faith and remember him as a joyful big brother and athlete whose loud singing in the shower will be sorely missed. We don't have any reason to believe that there was anything that was being done that was reckless or careless. Dad was doing what dads do on a farm, and the accident happened. Now, a GoFundMe account has been set up to help uh, George's family cover funeral and upcoming expenses. Dan? All right, Garna Mejia, live for us. Such a sad story. Our hearts go out to the family. Thanks, Garna. Well, turning to COVID.